everybody and welcome to a brand new series. This series, actually, I kind of have a lot of plans for this. It is a little bit more of a stripped down series. I don't have any, like, well, that's not true. I have one magic mod, but only because I really like one of the blocks in it. So we're not gonna be doing magic. This is all about a enhanced vanilla plus survival series. This series is called Homestead and it's exactly what it sounds like. We're gonna be just building ourselves a little homestead. We're gonna be, I mean, if you like Harvest Moon, Stardew Valley, My Time at Portia, Story of Seasons, any of those kind of games, this is gonna be your series, you guys, because honestly, those are the kind of games that I personally love myself. And I had a lot, hello! And we thankfully spawned like right by a village on the side of a river here. It was, and there's sunflowers. What more can you ask for? But it is the, the sun is coming up. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that is beautiful. Looks like there's a autumn-y looking forest over there. Oh my gosh, you guys. Uh, I think I kind of want to live with that behind me. That is absolutely stunning. But, um, oh, you guys have a blacksmith. Yes, hello. And yes, I do have I do have uh, shaders on this series because honestly, I love shaders and I would love to put shaders on like my Sablecraft series, but I cannot uh, because Sablecraft is already relatively laggy and buggy as you guys know. Well, ooh, food. Yes, this is this is everything we need because food is slightly, I'm, just, I'm gonna take your chest too because you know what? I probably can use that. And as you see, I do have a wooden pickaxe here because I did start with a little starter chest Let's just see. We will probably, hello, uh, we'll probably be having to live in this village. Yeah, no, there's nothing in here. Uh, for the time being, until we get enough resources to be able to actually like make our own home. Because I also have um, primal core as well on this. So it's not, you have a tree in your house, madam. There you go. Um, I'm gonna steal your bookshelves. Sorry about that. But as I was saying, uh, we have Primal Core, we have Better with mods, we have all these kind of mods that enhance the vanilla experience. They... M okay, that was weird for a second. I thought she was hitting me with a sword. Why are you looking at me like that? I'm sorry, I need the books. Jeez. These villagers are awfully judgy, you guys. I mean, serious. Look at them just staring at me. Okay, goodbye. Oh no, I'm... Almost goodbye. I'm taking your crafting table. Now goodbye. Alrighty, I think this is gonna be the house that we kind of set up shop in for now until we are able to actually, um, you know, go out on our own and have our own little, our own little house. But for now, we cannot because we have nothing. We literally have a few apples, a peach, bread, some wood, and sticks and some books and stuff. Yeah, we would die instantly if we went out on our own. Okay, um, do, 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 where do I want to put this? I guess this could go like here and then that. Did I ask you to place there? I don't think so. There we go. Oh, I hear piggies. <gasps> do you guys hear piggies? I hear piggies. Ah, little piggies. Hello, little piggy. <gasps> Baby pig. Oh, it's so cute. Hello. And, and that is another thing that I want to be doing in this series. A little rule, I guess you could say, that I set for myself. I will not be killing the farm animals unless I raise them myself. That is right. We are not just gonna go out and just slaughter. I mean, obviously when we start starving, maybe we'll have to rethink this, but I think that, um, I don't think I'm going to actually just, you know, like just take this pig and just, oh. Well, I didn't say I couldn't scavenge. Oh, and it just had another little- I'm stealing your baby, madam. I'm sorry. Come here. Come here, little one. Ha, you're mine now. 
sorry, I'm stealing your baby, it's just too cute. I cannot handle the amount of cuteness this baby pig has. Oh my gosh, <gasps> hello, oh you're so cute, look how tiny, look how tiny. It's like a fourth a block tall, you guys. It's so cute. R.I.P. little pig who died in a tree. I really don't even know how that just happened. I just stood there and was like, what? You were fine, and then you were in a tree. Minecraft, you guys, Minecraft. But I think actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in there and that peach, and I think um, I want to keep six of the apples set aside because we can actually make apple trees. And I think that once we get our farm going, that uh, some apple trees would be, would not be amiss. They would be fantastic. Oh my lord, you are adorable. Okay. Well, now that we've spent nearly all our day looking at cute little pigs, I think we need to go out. We need to grab some flint because that is primal core for you. You need flint in order to make the first set of tools. Yeah, and it's about noon now. And if you notice, we don't have journey map or anything. Oh, we could also use some clay, honest, if I'm being completely honest. Yeah, we don't have journey map. We don't have anything like that because that's not exactly realistic. You don't have a constant, uh, perfectly updating map all the time. Like I said, vanilla plus, you guys. So anything that, I mean, I have a few things that probably like chisel and whatnot that wouldn't really, um, that they probably wouldn't put in vanilla Minecraft, but I mean most of this stuff really it would like vanilla Minecraft could use it. Let's put it that way. Okay. Um, where is the flint? Oh yeah, we do have some fishies swimming around. Look at those. Those are gonna be really important. I think you guys. Those are going to probably keep us alive when we are starving and we don't have enough food. Oh, good morning, everybody. I have been out all night gathering materials and trying not to die and eating these didn't mean to place those why did i place those and eating these black raspberries uh to stay alive pretty much so yeah I, oh, i'm full hi trista hello but now that we are safely back in our little in our little house oh hi apparently i'm sharing a house with you okay sure um, we need to get going. We need to start making a few- Oh, look at the baby pig has gotten bigger! We need to get going making a few tools, you guys. We need a better pickaxe and we need an axe. We definitely- I think an axe is first on the list. Also a sword. A sword would have been really useful while I was running away from everything last night. Okay, um, we need a- Do -do 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 axe like that okay so we need to do all this flaked flint stuff which basically let's just put our blueberries in that actually let's also i was um gathering all like i was eating the little um little garden things that payne's harvest craft gives you those are pretty useful and then let's just throw all this stuff in there don't need this don't need those those uh put that there right so let's get going so you put the, you take all the gravel and you do one there, one there, and then you get all this flint and that's 25 flint. And then you have to hit it on the stone like so. Oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, good. And then you get flaked flint. See? Boom. And the little, little bits of flaked flint pop off uh, every so often. Oh, here it is. It was landing outside. I was wondering what was going on with all our flaked flint. I'm like, I see it flaking, but I'm not getting any flint. Okay, back inside. Alrighty, now that we have our flaked flint, we also, I also, while I was out, I was punching grass and I was getting this plant fiber. So you take said plant fiber and you let's just evenly distribute that okay we have two extra and then you put three in an l shape like that and you get plant twine which is you know like i said very it's primal core you guys it's very primal so you need the flint and then you tie it together with twine and a stick and it's, it's it's all it's all very cool okay so then let's create this flint axe perfect and then we need to create i think honestly we need a better um a pickaxe for sure we need a better pickaxe and then we probably do is there a sword that's what I, I guess we'd have to make a stone sword wouldn't we I don't think they have a uh, flint sword <laughs> but let's make a flint shovel and let's make a 
flint handsaw and a, I think a flint, oh, we're missing one whole piece of flint. No! Um, back to get more gravel. Alrighty, we have gravel and honestly, we probably should, hi buddy, uh, abduct these sheep and <laughs> put them inside a house because oh hello piggies actually there's plenty of sheep i'll i'll leave you outside um because we really should make a bed you guys a bed would have been super useful last night where is my house this is it well it's not my house it's someone's house i'm just living in it okay so now we have got more gravel Oh, we got all the flint that we need and what was it a work blade? That's right. Yes a work blade and um, What else should we make? Right well now that we have a, a, a fair amount of tools I think we probably should go mining get a little more coal make a few more torches and who knows? I can't remember if the flint pickaxes can mine. I Really that's how you buy then okay Rude little piglet. Okay, um, let's go down into the mines. Um, let's open up our inventory. Let's put our torches in our offhand for a little bit of light. Oh, it's so dark. Okay, there we go. And there's iron right here. I don't hear anything. I don't see anything. Ooh, it does. It mines iron. Ooh, this is a like halfway decent vein of iron. Oh, I don't know why, but my first trips into the mine, doesn't matter how many times I've done this, still a little nerve wracking. Yeah, but I'm not seeing anything, so let's just keep going. Right, well, I think that's about all the coal that there is down here, so I think, ooh, is it getting dark out? No, we're still good. Oh, but it's the sun is going down, so I think we should definitely head back into the safety of our house and keep craft. Oh, my, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Hi. Okay, that's fine. I don't mind sharing the house with you, but we got a decent amount of coal and we got 17 pieces of iron. Uh, do we have enough? Please, 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 please. Okay, good. We do. I say, please tell me we have enough cobblestone to make a furnace because otherwise the iron does us no good. Okay, good. Plop the furnace down, then put about half the coal in, and then put the iron in and get the iron a smelting. Is it just me? Or are the villagers in this town super weird? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm thinking now that we've got a little bit of iron, we really should go out and try to, I think, get some string. Because honestly, wait, I think really what I should do first is a chest plate to uh, protect myself slightly better. And then uh, we need one more piece for a sword. Oh, I feel like... Probably this is not my smartest idea, but oh well. Put away everything that we don't need so that when we die, we don't lose too much stuff. And out we go. I'm probably gonna regret this, but oh well. Hello, Mr. Spider. Come here. I need your string. No, come back. Gotcha. Oh, hey everybody. Do, 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 do. Good sir, there are a lot of baddies over there. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Hi, ow, hi, ow. Yeah, you, you get him. You show him. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Hello, creeper. Okay, well, we need the gunpowder. Back away, back away, back away. Back away, back away. One more hit, one more hit! No, two more hits, two more hits! Ah, we got him. Oh, we got him, you guys. <laughs> Look at me go. First night out, killing all the things. Ooh, what are these little glowy dots? They're beautiful. I hear the skeleton. Ow! Oh, there you are. Thank you. I oh, he even donated a bow! How kind! Thank you, good sir, even though it is almost broken. I mean, uh, there's another creeper. Are you kidding me right now? I hate creepers. There, I can literally handle any other mob. I just hate creepers so much. Probably because anytime I build anything beautiful and wonderful, they blow it up. 
without fail. These red dots also keep throwing me off. I keep thinking they're spiders and they're not. And ooh, more bones. Can I can I pick up the bones and the arrows? Yeah, boy. Okay. Make sure that creeper isn't following us. No, he's over there. Um, I see you are trapped, but there is nothing I can do. I left my pickaxe elsewhere. Ooh, look at they've been busy killing all these zombies. Ow! Who did that? You, you come back here, good sir. Oh, I'm getting low. My hearts are getting low. I know what this is. It's people. We're just gonna throw that in there. Sorry uh, about that, but to be completely honest, I really don't want to carry around people. People flesh. That's just gross. Okay. Um. Oh, creeper. Ooh, spider. Hello, spider. Ow. Ow! Don't- you can't- you can't gang up on me, like, ow! Yeah, well, that's kind of my fault, you know? I really wasn't watching my hearts. Oh, what? The heckadoodle? Okay, well, give me a moment. This is not what I expected. Alrighty, welcome back. We are back, I think? I honestly have no idea, I think, because I didn't set- my spawn- I don't know why I spawned there because originally- I don't know you guys. This game is weird. Sometimes it does the weirdest things. Minecraft does the darndest things. Okay, I'm hearing lots of grumblies. Lots of zombie- zombie noises. Oh boy. I think I can take him, you guys. I think I can take him. Hey, buddy. Everybody loves kung fu fighting. Whack! Haha! -ha! You're not that tough. I've got this. I've got this. Oh yeah. Why are you in a karate suit? That's what I want to know. Well, good morning. We survived the night. Mine is dying the one time, you guys. It was just a, that was just a, that was my fault, honestly. I mean, to be completely honest, I wasn't watching my hearts. So, what I want to do is there is this like uh, iron fishing rod thing that I think I actually want to craft said iron fishing rod. And if I remember correctly, you do it like uh, how do you do this? I don't remember actually. Okay, uh, we need to make this little iron hook thingy. Um, and then we need a stick and string. Yeah, okay. String? Stick. There we go! Okay, we should have everything! Yes, we do! We now have a iron fishing rod. That is going to be really useful for us uh, to get some some food because I mean oh, it's still obviously winter is still snowing and um, we're not gonna be really able to grow too many crops I think in weather like this we'll have to wait for it to actually be spring so I probably should eat a bit and time to go fishing the next order of business is a bed, you guys. I ah, gotta love that early game grind. Hello, sheepskies. I'm so sorry. I know it's a little cold, but you know, I need to sleep. Okay, where did the other little sheepy? Oh, hi. You look like a, a kiwi, not like the fruit, like the like the bird, you know. Um, there were tons of sheep. There they are. Hello, sheepsies. Hello. Thank you for the wool. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I think, can you turn the wool into string? That's what I want to know. Right, well, we have this merino wool, and then we, yeah, we have white and brown merino wool, which is actually a really good, why am I doing stone? Which is actually a really good quality of wool. So, we just need three of those, like so, three of those, like so, and boom, a bed. Uh, I would like to die said bed, but, you know... Beggars can't be choosers. And now, hopefully, what if we sleep here, it's not nighttime. When we sleep there, we will respawn here and um not in the middle of a snowy forest. That was so weird. That I wonder if I died again if I was respawn like somewhere else. Questions. Questions that probably should never be answered. Alrighty, we are off again. There were these bushes, uh, these blackberry bushes. With, were these them that I was picking 
berries. Now that's orange milkweed. I was picking these berries off of them and the berries actually were quite filling. I would like to find said blackberry bushes again. Pick them. I think these are them. Are these them? <gasps> they are them. Okay, can I take them? Yeah, I can take them with me. Yes. Okay, we are, we are taking all of these with us and then we are going to replant them close to our house for a fantastic and filling food source. Sweet. I've actually never played Minecraft where I actually eat kind of the diet that I myself eat. Although I myself, I'm like intolerant to many different types of protein. So I actually can't eat animal meat at all. Um, so that's like no, you know, no beef, no chicken, no pork, no, none of it. I can't eat any of it. Um, and then I'm also lactose intolerant and sugar intolerant. Okay, don't you dare eat my berries. Move along, thank you. Three, there we go. Those are six little, we don't, we don't, we don't need any of this. I don't know what you are, but you can go over there. Okay, um, yeah, we got six little berry bushes growing now and hopefully eventually they will grow us some blackberry. Why am I hearing bad things? Oh, because there are bad things. I guess it is now nighttime. Please die. Thank you. Goodbye. Um, excuse me. I did not make that bed for you. Get out. Get, 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 get. Okay. We're sharing a bed. Okay, that's fine. You, madam. That is my bed. Screw you. But alright you guys, I think that is actually where I'm going to leave this very first episode of Homestead. As always, thank you so, so much for watching and please, if you enjoyed this video at any point, please leave a like on this video and subscribe if you are new to my channel because I have something very special planned for this series. This is a series I think I might do half on YouTube, half on Twitch. So yes, I will. Once I learn how to do it, I've been teaching myself. It's a struggle, you guys. I have been teaching myself how to live stream once I'm comfortable and I feel like I know how to live stream well enough that I can provide a good experience for you guys. I think then we should live stream for sure. I would love to be able, what's going on with me today? I'm doing an outro, dude. Please move along. Uh, but yeah, I would love to be able to live stream with you guys and chat with you guys live. Um, that is just something I've really wanted to do since I even started my YouTube channel. So hopefully I will fulfill that dream and we will, we will live stream Homestead. But until then you guys, I'll see you later. Goodbye.